Next up for Manchester United in the Premier League is Southampton away at St Mary's. Southampton currently in ninth position, Man United top of the table, equal with Manchester City. Fantastic start to the season, continued that with a 4-1 win over Burton Albion in the League Cup. But can we continue it at a ground I think we drew 0-0 last season? Here is who I predict to be in that starting eleven. Unsurprisingly, David Gea, he's in my starting eleven, coming back in for Romero, who I think played well. But Romero is not our first choice. De Gea showed against Everton and has done all season. For me, he's the world's best goalkeeper. That's my opinion. You may disagree, but you definitely, definitely won't. Right back, Antonio Valencia, after his thunderbastard volley that he scored against Everton, he's going to be in good form and he got rested against Burton. The one thing we've got to do with Valencia this year, we saw burnout towards the end of the season. We need to use him, not sparingly, but if he can be rested for a League Cup game, rest him. That's what Mourinho did against Burton. Centre-back partnership of Phil Jones and Eric Bai. Once again, I don't think Mourinho's going to change it. Victor Lindelof and Chris Smalling aren't doing enough to get into that team. And we've only conceded two goals this season, both in the game against Stoke. So I think Jones and Bai will both keep their place. And at left-back, I've gone for Daley Blind because I think Mourinho will play him. I want to play Luke Shaw there, but until Luke Shaw has shown enough to Mourinho in training and in games, to earn his start in 11 position, I don't think we'll see Luke Shaw start a game. I don't think that's going to happen at his former club, Southampton. Now, midfield partnership, I've gone for Matic and Fellaini. Again, Fellaini's been playing well this season, so you can't lambast Mourinho for putting him in the starting 11. You can for the fact that I think Herrera would be a better player in that role, but until Fellaini plays badly, I don't think Mourinho's going to drop him. And Matic has just been absolutely phenomenal. A revelation in midfield, and long may it continue. Now, I've gone for a front three behind Lukaku of Mata, Rashford, and Mkhitaryan. Martial on the bench. Again, this is my predicted 11, not what I would play, because Martial was phenomenal against Burton. But this is what I think Mourinho will play. With Rashford on the left-hand side, Mata in the middle, and Mkhitaryan on the right, but Mata and Mkhitaryan sort of rotating in their positions. And Lukaku back up front. Can he score? Can he make it six in six Premier League games? I think he can. Southampton's defence has been wobbly. They've conceded as many goals as they scored this season, which is only four. But Southampton are definitely a beatable team. And I think with this start at 11 and the way Manchester United are playing, we're definitely going to be favourites going into the game. But who would you start? Would you start Anthony Martial out on the left instead of Marcus Rashford? Or would you maybe play Martial, Rashford and Lukaku? That would be a, an unreal front three, but I don't know whether Mourinho will do it. This is my predicted 11, not what I would play. But let me know your predicted 11 and your preferred 11 in the comments below. As always, drop a like on the video, ladies and gents. And if you are new to United People's TV, hit that subscribe button. Take it easy.